Hello, everybody. Welcome back to uh, episode two of TFC from Muckin' About and Spotter's Guide and all that other stuff. So today, uh, just going to get used to being in TFC again. Uh, I can't play as carefree as I usually do in Minecraft, feeling confident about my surroundings. So, we are trimming trees. I thought I would become a florist, and this works out pretty well. But actually, <laughs> a little more serious nature here. Okay, so um, decided to build more of a permanent uh, housing area, or at least start uh, working on uh, a more permanent housing area, as our little uh, hidey hole shack, which has all of our beds and stuff in it right now, is fairly small. So I just walked uh, a little bit to, I believe I'm the east. Their spawn, I believe our house is right on that hill there. So I'm just a little bit to the east. Oh, no. I found a little island out in all this water. Uh, from watching Pack Rat and playing a little bit yesterday and a little bit uh, so far today, uh, having source water within three or four blocks is pretty much a must have, or you will spend a lot of time walking around. So this uh, solves that problem. As you can see, we are also on like a huge thing of freaking clay again. So I'll be able to deal with that. And um, over here, I have a wall of peat that I can go and nab. Use that for some uh, burning material while we keep the hickory for uh, metalworking, as well as uh, potentially building and such. So that'll be a nice little thing there. Uh, the other thing with the flowing water is I actually haven't found any metals over on this island as of yet. But we could set up some sluicing. Oh. Uh, these are my piglets. That one's a female. That one's a male. We will uh, be using those to breed eventually. I hope to collect a female and male chicken, a female and a male cow. But right now I'm just clearing off this island. Looking at the types of rock, I'm getting schist and marble. So I gotta be like right in the middle of where those two uh, change. That's a schist. These are all kind of a darker color here. That was a marble. That was a schist again. So they're kind of intermixed. It looks like it's a uh, east-west split here. If I go a little bit more to the uh, east. We get into the marble, which is, of course, a flux material. Oh, look at that. More peat. Holy crap, a lot more peat. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Ooh, is that schist again? Yeah, I don't see a new stone. So maybe it's uh, northeast <laughs> is the uh, marble. Ooh, got a couple of mushrooms. Do mushrooms still grow like normal? Or no, mushrooms are useless. They don't make anything, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, I remember that now. <laughs> so, un -oo for the mushroom. <laughs> Alright. So I think the other thing I'm actually going to do is chop down most of the natural wood that's here. Uh, we will replant it, we will regrow it, we'll even make a little tree farm. Uh oh. Looks like it's getting dark out. Alright, we will be... Heading back to the bed right now. That answers my question. What's that? that? Are we trying to go back? But that answered my question. Yeah. Uh, the game is very, very dangerous. And there's very little you can do to defend yourself until you get into metal, so we sleep. Although I'd swear, standing in an area for a day was supposed to give you like three days of protection. That does not seem to be the case anymore. That is a metric I will have to look up. Oops. I am in the middle of a clay field, which means I am slightly to the north of the base. Get off the walls, so that just in case a monster comes by, he doesn't see you. Yeah. Alright, I am in bed. And there we go. Uh, I'm going to take uh, two stakes. 
Mostly because I, cool. I need to eat two steaks right now. <laughs> and what have I found? Onion seeds, yellow bell pepper seeds, maize seeds, potato, and squash. Uh, why do I have ceramic molds on me? Shoot. There's the bow. Where did we get all the arrows from, anyways? Just I made skeletons, or you found a lot of flint? No, I made a bunch. I no, you can just use the regular rock. Oh, you can nap them now. Yeah. Uh, well, you don't nap them. You just put a rock and a stick and a feather in the crafting grate. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's shapeless. Nice. Yeah, I had a power two bow that I got off a skeleton, but that didn't last long. I thought I needed a lot more arrows than I actually could use. All right, back out I go. <laughs> Actually, I might just take my bed with me this time. Avoid the dangers of the run. Is this uh, somebody's mine here? Yep. Into rock, I guess somebody made a pick? Yep. I didn't. No, I didn't. Uh, careful, some of that dirt there will fall. Yeah, it will, so don't walk around too much. Okay, so back off to the northeast. There's a block without any grass on it. Is that the... Oh. Let's see what time of year it is. November. Figures. Well, it's I had nice green grass. Until today. <laughs> this 2013 would be mine time. What year is it? Whoa. Oh, jeez. That freaked well, me out. It's year 1000. 1000? Yeah, we got a little ways to go. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, same growing rules for sugarcane as before? Like just yep. vanilla mine rules? Or mm -hmm. vanilla minecraft? Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that. That really is a huge wall of peat. Okay, I'm thinking of making a peat house now. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's gotta be a bit over two chunks long. And then about 18 blocks, eh, 12 blocks or so away from that, there's another patch of it here. So there's like a lot of peat over here. A little bit of gravel at the bottom of this river. That will come in handy. Mm -hmm. And just further to the east of us is all that sand we saw yesterday. Alright, but I'm going to start growing some more of this. So there we go there. There we go, loop de loo So this is our little pig pen. This is temporary. I'll test it out. Seems solid. Mm -hmm. uh, we're going to want to do a nice collection of sticks. You know, I don't need hundreds of them, but hundred would be good. <laughs> so this will be a little bit of a slow process of finding. I'm not going to do a perfect trim here. I think we should, uh, we, should well, we should leave the shack here. There we go. It's, it's right next to Slime, in case we ever do die. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Yeah. I'm going to just build my house a little bit north of Spawn, where my farm is. Yeah, I'm just off to the northeast. I'm not that far away. No, but I mean, like, if, you, if you ever go out exploring you think or something and you die... You're you probably know. pretty close to me. I think I'm more northwest, though. <laughs> if you're more northwest, then we're not that close. I'm a little bit north and mostly east. Alright, alright, yeah, then... Alright. Nowhere close. <laughs> alright, so we got one oak, eight hickory saplings. Uh, is it alright if I come over and snag some saplings off of a willow? Uh, I have ten right now. You could, um, I'm in a forest of willows, so yeah. There so no, I wasn't sure who brought those back. I just know they weren't there when I logged out last night. And cows will follow only wheat. barley or just wheat. Okay. Uh, what do you, uh, do you chickens want to explain follow? It? The uh, the farm animals follow wheat grain, uh, but they will accept any grain to breed. Okay. So wheat to get them to follow me back to my place, and then any sort of grain like the uh, the barley or the oats or anything. Yeah. What 
the way that Minecraft works is you have to set an item that they accept to the, the, that they want you that they want to follow around. But you can choose any item for breeding, any items you want. Okay. You have to give a specific item ID to the other one. Wow, Hickory takes a little bit to knock down, doesn't it? I'm right back. Alrighty. Let's get the Hickory over here. And we'll just start making a log pile over here by the edge of the water. Actually, let me, let me fill that back in there. Oops. Have to shift click. I forgot about that. Yeah, it's annoying. I did that with the leather. Well, I'm always used to shift clicking is the alternate. But for TFC, it's storing the, the logs. I'd, I'd expect the alternate to be making it a log, you know? Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. So, just keeps catching me off guard. I'll learn, hopefully, huh? you know, before it's going to be a real critical pain in the ass. <laughs> well, I don't think you should change that, actually, because you, if, if you right-click with the log in your hand, it should place the log, not a log file. Whoa, squids. I'm gonna need those for ink. I should go smack them. Can you drown a squid? You should be able to drown a squid. Huh. Oh, stop trying to bailer arena away. Alright, up, up, up! Onto dry land, I command thee! Probably gonna waste my entire axe on this thing, aren't I? Yep. Mine. You should at least be somewhat afraid of me. Run that way, you stupid thing. No, no, no. No, no, no. That way. Yes, that way, finally. Now I shall knock you up there. Yes, yes. Shallow water. Go to the shallow water. <laughs> Alright, up on the dry land. Up on the dry land. Alright, I don't think I can get it up onto dry land. Bah. Screw you, you stupid Maybe squid. <laughs> All that work for one piece of ink. Oh, I found copper. It, nice. <clears throat> oh, I think I can see your farm from here, uh, Mike. Probably. Yeah, I can see you. Hey, yo! Hey, neighbor! Can you see me in the water? Uh. Jumping up and down yeah, to the, uh, okay. yeah. the southeast. That's awesome. <laughs> We are across the bay. Yeah, pretty cool. Oh, found some considerate as well. Very nice. So that's how you get bronze, right? Those two mixed together? Yep. How do you make a boat? A boat? Boat. Same as Villa. Just with planks with instead of logs, planks. right? Yeah, with the pl plank blocks. Uh. Plank blocks? Yep. Okay. I will remember. Oh, 
and of course that was the one leaf I didn't want to break, and I exactly knew I didn't want to break that one. Pointed at it and broke it. <laughs> Let me... Oh, uh, sun is going down. I'm setting out my bed just right there. Anybody uh, who's ever watched me in TFC will yeah. know that I do this a lot. You can only sleep at night. I'm pretty close to night here. Yeah, I should shift click that and maybe I'll get to it eventually. Alright, I'm in bed. Same. I'm out, though. Alright, there we go. It is now day again, uh, Mike. Alrighty. And let us get our choppy axe out. I more want the sticks on top of this tree than <laughs> I want the tree down right now. There we go. So one of the other projects is going to be for this island is uh, to actually make it an island. I'm not sure if you guys saw earlier when we were running around a little bit, but to the east we are actually connected to land. It's a fairly narrow bridge, so it won't be too hard. But we'll actually replace it with a bridge. There we go. Let's get on here. Uh, so today is going to be mostly uh, maintenance-y stuff, I believe. Just, you know, trying to settle back in again. Uh, get used to the, the time of things. Like, you know, paying attention to the sun. I'm used to freaking ignoring the thing. <sighs> but you don't have to pay attention to the sun, though. Well, it gets dangerous at night. And no, I, you say you can pay attention to pressing N. Nah. Weird. That would annoy me. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I don't want to have to hit a pop-up and then hit it again. I'd rather just take a quick glance at the sky and see where the sun is. Alright. Alright, got some more hickory, I think. Yep, goes in there. You know what awesome would be, uh... I don't know how you do it, but like, actual having to make a calendar? I don't know about a watch, because that might be kind of tedious, but... Or a sundial? Like making one in the world, or...? Uh, well, Sunday would have to be in the world, but I mean, like, a uh, calendar, yeah. Instead of just giving them all this information. Uh. Crafting branch is made out of planks, or yep. the, uh, no, the blocks? vanilla planks. Blocks. So I have to make, uh, four blocks? Yeah. I don't know if I really want to do this out of Hickory. Hickory looks pretty nice. Alright, our first crafting bench. Yay! We will put it in the place of a tree we probably chopped down that was Hickory. And now we will do what we really wanted to do and make a chest. <laughs> or four. Can't you... Yes, you can. Cool. So this is my Hickory Aspen Oak chest. You can see the, the nice fine lines of uh, contrast around the outside. <laughs> Alright, we'll put our seeds in here and some dirt and such in here as we don't need to store all of this on ourselves. There's our saplings. We probably want to get those growing kind of quickly. Put those out there for now. I can hear your... Uh, Action typing? Typing, by the way. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, okay. So... Ah. Oh, logs. Don't want them to go away. Nope, didn't trim this tree yet. I've almost got my goal of 100 sticks here. And it's not like there isn't a whole bunch of trees right around me. There we go. Let's get rid of this tree now.
timber. There we go. Okay, 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 okay. Did you get your, um, railroad saplings? No, I have not yet. Do you mind if I bring them to you? No, go ahead. <laughs> I do not mind delivery. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay, next thing we're going to want is a little bit of a fireplace here. Oh, that's weird. Why does my arm do that? When I'm looking in, like, a certain quadrant, my arm goes in front of my face. No, it doesn't seem... Now it's like the... Inverted? What the hell? Somebody's screwing with me. Now it doesn't do it at all! No! Ah, thank you. There's things down yep. So I'll put these in the chest with those. Alright, fire starter. Oops, there we go. And we'll throw down a little pile of sticks. It takes minimum of three sticks to start a fire, or four? Three. Three, okay. There we go, yay! Let's get our, our meat of cooking here. I and need to use your packing table real quick. Yeah, that's fine. And I'm actually going to go get some peat to stoke this fire with. There we go. So we got our shovel. It's a good thing to collect peat with. Oh, our sugar cane has indeed started to grow. Yay! Let's knock down this wall. Do you have so many charcoal? Uh, no, I definitely have not started a charcoal pit yet. Yeah, I've not been worrying about that at all. We're at the stage where we need to know. And by we, we mean you. <laughs> I think you're the other one amongst us who has metal, man. I'm up for sharing. No, no, I've, yeah, I'm just saying. I'm not to that point yet. So I'm assuming, like, the, the next thing on your list is going to be a chisel for a bloomery? I've already got a chisel. Oh, okay. Uh, so, next thing on your list is going to be a furnace? <laughs> you mean a, yeah, a bloomery, you don't. Well, the, the bloomery and then the, uh, uh, but forge you, thingy. You already know how to make that stuff, right? Yeah, the block shape, I'm assuming that hasn't changed. Okay, well, bricks are a little different. Um, you'll, you'll notice that when you use a chisel on a block, or on a rock, you'll get a, uh, a slightly different um, you get a slightly different item and that item you get is still what you use eight of them and a piece of charcoal to make the bloomery block but to make brick blocks you'll need to process them a little bit yeah, okay that's uh, something that's up on the wiki yeah Oh, it's all up on the way. Oh, your brother, it, your brother and I cleared up once we got the when Bill seventy six came out. There we go. Uh, I assume it's kind of like making like the rock equivalent of the the plank blocks. Is you, you piece the, you make the little or bricks and you kind of piece them together or something. Well, yeah, but you need to make mortar. Okay. One simply does not walk into mortar. Water is made from uh, water, flux, and sand, or what? Or sand and lime water. No clay. No, if you look it up, it's made from lime water and sand. Really? IRL. Yes. I was like, we have those things. We are back. Idiot. Wow, I suck. That's Do six you? blocks of clay that didn't drop a single freaking ball. All right. Well. Have, have fun sucking. <laughs> Great. I put my bed on top of clay. <laughs> right? I'm digging it out so I can see where my water edge is actually going to be once uh, uh -huh. once I remove the clay. Alright, I'm back. Welcome back, sir.
And there goes another shovel. Let's make another one real quick. And I will hold down the shift key to make people happy. There we go. And back to digging up the clay. So I'm assuming these little blocks of dirt inside of my clay are were actually where the trees were. I'm fairly certain they dump a uh, piece of dirt underneath them when they grow from uh, World Gen. I can kite them around keep them on me. There we go, that should wrap around. Nope, get stuck by that one piece there. And it looks like we're heading towards another night. Mm -hmm. And I will be ready to sleep. Or I am ready to sleep. Alright, we need to... The sun has to be like halfway down on the horizon before that actually lets you sleep. But this will give me my opportunity to move my bed off the clay. Mm -mm 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 -mm. There we go. Only move a bed when you can actually sleep in it again. Alright, I'm in bed. Me in bed. too. Sweet. Alright, same here. I got some more grains. Nice. Alright, cool. Um, rice. If you guys want to plant it. Uh, I have rice already, if, uh, if you want it, Chris. Well, do we need, uh, do you need, like, a water bed for the rice? Or no. does it just... Not, like, a rice patty? Yeah. No. No, just plant. I don't think he has done anything really to, to um... Distinguish? Yeah, distinguish the different crops from uh, farming methods. Okay. Is farming getting some uh, 77 love there, Dunk, or is uh, there Not other planned. focuses right now? Other focuses for the most part. Mostly yeah. combat and metal metallurgy. Ooh. And then metallurgy was off limits. No, no, we're... Didn't you hear it's being changed, like, entirely? Nope. I oh. have not heard anything. I told you, like, ten minutes ago. Really? Yeah. You're seriously not screwing with me right now? Well, I mentioned, uh, you, you said, the first, last time you mentioned that um, Max is like pretty dead set in, uh, in not changing metallurgy, I said, well, that's weird because it's completely different at build 77. Oh. <laughs> oh. I totally missed that. Can you give us any highlights? Um. Wait, Yeah, well, I mean, I can talk about it as much as you guys want right now. Yeah, that's it's, fine. Uh, all right. I'm interested to see how s if there's any similarities between what was designed for TFC2 or not. Um, first stage of growth, so we're actually making it so plank, planks can't be made without a saw. Okay. Um, the first, the first stage of, uh, of development begins with the pottery age. So you're going to be making a lot of things out of clay and like the urns and uh, jugs and stuff like that. And mm -hmm. so that's going to replace your basic wooden tools, uh, like certain urns to hold uh, items in, like chests. Okay. Um, vessel and jugs to hold your water and stuff. Uh, we're going to introduce kilns, which are going to be your uh, initial smelting device. You're going to put your ore in a clay vessel and then stick it in a kiln for a number of hours while, while the metal will melt. Um, it does allow for a lot more metal to melt at once. Your first metal is actually going to be copper instead of tin, zinc, and bismuth. Um, the bloomery will only be used to smelt iron and we're adding a blast furnace to make steel. And cool. oh, adding a blast furnace, okay. Yep. Okay, that's pretty cool. Hmm. Are you gonna have to? Uh, well, yeah, you are. I knew I have to ask that. Okay guys, I'm going to work on clearing off this island, and uh, maybe not all of it, but a good portion of it, and we'll be right back after that. Alright guys, we're back, so just got a little bit left here to do. Uh, I'm on axe number 10, 11, and 12, and this should be enough to get rid of these last three trees. <laughs> hmm.
Well, so this is where I'm looking at putting the uh, the split in the island. So I'll be digging through the water right there to my right, over there to my left. And I got a shovel and a half or so to do that with. This is the larger part of the island, uh, you can see on the, the mini-map here. Uh, I'm not going to be settling this right now, maybe I'll settle it later, but I'm just looking at doing uh, the this island on the left. I actually like how you can see that the clay is a have a semicircle there. Oh, sun is going downwards. So is that really the semicircle of the clay? Yeah, that's the clay. Which means those light areas up on the map might also be more clay. Man, it's all over the place. All right, let's I see found some right next to me as well. <laughs> nice. See if we can't uh, get one more tree before it gets too far into night here. Every time we sleep, I lose a lot of food. Nope. Oh, and here's the start of some peat. It's actually a lot of peat right there, so we'll be getting more to stoke our fire with. And I think my fire could use a little stoking. Yep. Let's add that in there, get that cooking, add another... Alright, I'm in bed. There we go. Back to daylight. No, not too bad of a hit on my hunger that time. And I think we're going to leave that tree, because it's going to technically be on the other side. So we'll just go up this way here. Grass is always the hardest to shovel. And the trick here is going to be seeing if we can't get this to be source water. This is going to be a little bit hard. Might have to dig more than we want to and put some back. There we go with that. So I can technically get source water as far back as here. This should meet up with these blocks. Yeah, see? So there's a plan. There's a method to this madness. What? You never. Ta. Maybe that it's just, you know, a statement that no matter what you do, there will always be uh, some discernible pattern in any amount of chaos. Yep. There we go. Uh, unfortunately, that's where it ends, though. I'm going to have to have flowing water until we're able to move source blocks, I can only go into here with the rest of the water. Insert complaint here. <laughs> yes, I'm gonna try and keep the things I that annoy me down to a vocal minimum. But for now, just gathering this peat will keep my uh, steak fire burning longer. I wonder how much uh, finite water I could dump into here to try and make it fill up. There we go. Not exactly island perfect. Let's just edge out right here. And there went my shovel. Knew it. There goes another. So let's just nap ourselves another shovel real quick. There we go. Okay, so that got our water flowing a little bit closer to each other, but not a lot. We will eventually have to figure out a solution for this. I do not want the water running there forever, but now we can... Oh! Pick up a shovel. But now we can focus on the rest of this island here. 
So I've left the uh, the pig pen here. The uh, I would like to get uh, a male and a female cow, a male and a female sheep, and a male and a female chicken, and add them into their nice new homes here. These guys, however, no more use. These are just more female pigs. Oh, screw you, pig. Get out of here. Should be able to technically nap. That should give me two knife blades. Yeah, that was annoying me with hoe heads before. Oh, damn it. Ugh, damn it. Female, female, male. Alright, you should die. So, for my efforts, I got one raw hide and a pork chop. See what we get when we bow hunt this guy, because screw that. We fix bows, we should use bows. Ah, stop eating, you bastard! Ah, oh, I bounced off of him! Whoa, 18 raw pork chops. You get quite a bit for slaughtering one of those little bastards. Yeah. Alrighty, so, we now have some pork to work with. And I was all impressed with how much uh, food Mike picked up earlier. <laughs> I just, you know, just not that impressed anymore, I guess. <laughs> So I'm going to build my house here, uh, actually over this clay pit. That is the, the plan. Get a little uh, over the water living going on. And I'm going to start that with some really nice oak. I'm going to use oak for the, uh, for the foundation. And unfortunately, I can't do my dirt outlines to try to figure out exactly what I want it to look like. So what I'm envisioning is a bit of a walkway out, so we'll get one there, we'll have a, uh, actually, let's uh, chop that back down, which is amazing, you know, I actually placed that one as intended. I'm usually trying to create log piles out of these things, and it just, you yeah, know, wrong button. <laughs> So if I want a three wide walkway, I'm going to place one here, one, two, three, we'll get rid of this here, place a log down there, and we'll just do a log every, let's do every four, one, two, three, four, so log here. Keeping it three wide. I'm actually going to do this as a specialty of three here. Oops, that side. And then over to. Why does that look too wide? Go around it. Yeah. Alright, since I already got it measured out, we want it there. We want it there. So. Ah, sniffy nose. We'll get rid of this log, then we'll get rid of the other inside log, swap that dirt with a piece of log, I don't think, yeah, log piles defy gravity. Yep. I defy thee, I defy thee to thy core. Alright take up this piece of dirt here, get those back, okay, so log back in there, let's use this for dirt, there we go, uh, that's too bright, better taste some dirt, so we'll have our walkway come out here, this will be like a little bit of a patio, and then we'll connect up to the house, uh, starting right here. So not too far from that little 
patio type thing. Whew. So we're doing good so far. Let's add that. And this means, whoa, that was not intended. Very much not intended. Let's uh, yoink our oak blocks out of here. Or our oak piles. Get that and that. So there's our walkway. Come here, little saplings. Actually, it's about time we got you guys growing. Let's uh, tuck away. No, the fire went out again my credit, that's the second time I've let my fire go out. I try not to let it burn through too much uh, peat at a time, though. Which is why I don't keep it full. Doing a little bit... Ooh, rye. Okay, so we now have rye squash, maize, green beans, potato, uh, yellow bell peppers, and onion seeds. I thought I had green bell pepper here a second ago. Maybe it's green beans. Eh, no big deal. Let's uh, get our little bit... Ooh, Sunny's going down there, Mike. I can see it before you do. But you didn't mention it. Well, I mean, I figured you'd notice. Uh, damn. I guess I'll harvest in a few days. My crops are pretty much starting to finish growing, or at least some of them. Nice. Yeah, so, first time I boys. got on today, they were all finished, and it was just like amazing sight. <laughs> so, making a bit of a wood farm here. I'm going to need a moment. No big deal. Let me just... Uh, Put a couple of oak down as well. One, two, one, two. Just so they all have about the same, uh, what is it, like 10 day cycle for the saplings to grow? Right. Yeah, that's what I'm told. I am in bed. Wonder what happened to Dunk? He just kind of got disconnected. Yeah. I was just thinking about that. Uh, oak hickory. Oh, I was planting the oak. <laughs> These oak, by the way, were a pain in the ass to get. Just so you all know. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Bless you. Uh, thank you. There we go. Uh, do saplings just randomly grow places? Talking to you, buddy. Talking to you. What the hell are you doing here? What? Now I have saplings that just pop up that I don't remember planting them there. That definitely wasn't me. Well, that's why I'm wondering if they just randomly pop up. And I swear I moved I out know, all the grass too. I think you might be right about that. I think I've seen some of that. But it's like late August. Or late autumn? Uh, it's no, we are early winter too. now. Yep. Early winter. It has happened. So it is written. So shall it be. It's crazy how fast. I, I like. I even felt that at one point it was uh, we were sleeping through more than one day or something. Yeah. Like the days counted as two. I know that feeling. Alright, where's our other... So we got a good amount of oak here and a good amount of hickory planks. And... Placement is going to be retarded. Come on. Alright. Need to write some suggestions about this, buddy. That I do. That I Placing definitely what? do. Uh, you can only get the planks to place on blocks at 90 degree angles, apparently. Oh, yeah. That ain't right. 
I have an issue with breaking planks. Uh, if you more than one are attached or something. Yeah, it takes they'll... out the entire block worth yeah. of planks. Okay, so there, we got our initial step up. And we are going to have some fun with this, actually, guys. This is going to be a pretty neat uh, creation here. Just swap out another kind here so I can freely go in. And these are the woods that I have to work with. And this is how I'm going to build my my dock going to be out of these two types of planks coming through here different segment lengths just look kind of like it was pieced together go away squid this is not a squid house No, oh my god, no. that was crazy. Damn it. No. What happened? Um, I follow Suits on TV, and uh, the new episode of Season 3 is just like the beginning of it. It's just come on, and it's just, wow, mind blown. Yeah, there we go. Got all of our hickory back. Let's do two there, and I think I was doing four on this side. Yeah. Not one right up against it, though. Whoa, did I really place one, like, way over there? Why does that look so dinky when I place it on water? Oh, it's actually sticking through the entire thing on water. But it's not actually going to show the bottom part. It must be... Alright, guys, we're back. So I finished off the uh, little bit of a dock here. A little bit of a dock. Uh, up to the entrance of where the threshold of the house will be. And I think this is where the actual solid planks are going to be coming back into play. Because it takes a little bit less of these. They don't maybe not look as nice. But I can fill an entire block. just like that. <laughs> and I'm one plank short of a third one. So that'll get me four, three, whatever. That actually looks really lame, doesn't it? <laughs> Yeah, maybe I am stuck, uh... Maybe I'm stuck doing... Oh, Jesus, look at the grass! Stupid grass. You better not screw with my... trees growing here. Alright, there we go. So, uh, just going to slowly start working on the house here. I have a ton of hickory. Uh, not so much oak. I really like some willow. Can I deconstruct these? No, I can't, apparently. That would be nice, but I just don't think it's in the cards. Let's go visit our crafting bench. Maybe we'll do some slabby. Can we do that? Yeah, we can still get slabs here. Okay. Can't go back. Yeah, that doesn't look too bad. So put this here. 
we'll do a bit of a deck around the outside, so we're going to definitely need more oak. Unfortunately, this is mostly a hickory forest here. It looks like... Okay, well, night is shortly coming on. I'm going to go hunt around... <clears throat> Woo, voice. I am going to go hunt around and see if I can't find a good place to get some oak. And we will pick up there. Alright guys, we're back. So I just went over to uh, Mike's over there and uh, picked up some oaks. And then I wandered around a little bit and found some sycamore. So it's all good. Let's, uh, let's make another axe here. There we go. So we can get some more of these planks done. And why not? We'll just do it all because, you know, it'd be nice to actually have a large house or at least some room in a house. Something that looks a little bit more than temporary. And this will get us 32 blocks. Stacks of eight. Woohoo! There we go. Uh, Sixty half slabs. And what I'm going to do with this is just kind of make a little outside area. Wrap this around this way. No. You will obey me shift. You will not step on the lily pad. Hoi. Alright, so if we go around that way, I can then come around over here. And on this side, I'm going to make a little bit of an offhang that goes back towards the land. And you know, maybe this will be like our back uh, barbecue patio. A little something like this. Let's add this up here. And now we have a derpy squid who really, really, really wants to go up on dry land. I can just I can just feel this here. He wants to go that way. Come on, come on. Yeah, that way, that way, that way. That way. Come on. Up the half slab. Up the half slab. There you go. There you go. One more block over. That's all you need, buddy. That's all you need. Yeah! There. What do you think of that, buddy? Easiest way to kill the squid. Up on land. Up on land. Alright, this one gave us three. Nice. Let's uh, get you over that way here. Oh no, damage! Ah! <laughs> so yeah, we got a six ink total from those two guys. That was very, very nice. Brings our total up to eight. When we start doing our recipes, we won't have any problem. Whoosh! Alright, so... We have our outside ring here, and I'll probably put the, I'm going to put like the, uh, extend the railing sort of thing and keep on doing it all the way around this place. But I think I'm going to put the, uh, the main entrance to my house right here. So let's uh, make a hickory door, maybe a sycamore door. I think I can just make those out of planks. 
Uh, let's see. Yep, that'll get me a door. But let's uh, not use the oak. Let's use something a little bit more interesting. There we go. There we go, guys. We got a house right here. Oh, yeah. 100% security. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. So it's not 100% security. Let's just uh, round off the torch on every log. Uh, the next thing we're going to do, I'm actually going to use the darker wood. Take some of this hickory here. And I'm going to put in support beams for the house. I'm going to actually use the darker wood for this. Uh, so we'll go... Whoa, whoops. There we go. We'll do that there. Or should I put that right here? Yeah, I'm going to chop that down. Let me give this a little bit more thought here. Oh. Does it not chop all these down when you hit the bottom one? That is annoying. If these are just facade blocks, they shouldn't take this long to chop back down. Rage! <laughs> Alrighty. Okay, so I'm going to get rid of that, and I'm going to put these in the corner here. So there we go there. That'll give us enough room between here and the door to do something with it. Uh, down here, I'm going to make the edge of the house be here. Kind of go out at an angle here now. Another one down. Okay, let's put two down there. Wait a second, which one of these is actually diagonal? I believe the first one I placed. Let's come out here. Just some nice random distance for a large house. Looks good, looks good. this one up here and there. So I want to follow that line here. Got it. Like Smith, do connect it. And that line here. Like Am I Smith, off by one? Disconnected. All right, there we go. For some reason, I thought uh, that was you connecting and disconnecting. Who was connecting and disconnecting? I thought it was you. I'm like, wait, I didn't remember him disconnecting. Then I looked over and I see both names I'm like, something weird's going on here. Oh, Nick, that's right. Uh. He hasn't stuck around for a couple of days now. I wonder if he, what he's, what he's checking to see if we're playing. Yeah. What would we have to play for him to stick around? He's been playing the mucking... Oh, the, uh... Uh, the other server that I was on. Just the normal mucking? Yeah. Eh. I 
do want to get back to there, but I've got a prep. I also want to record a couple of episodes on there too, though. Okay, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's about nighttime as well. Yeah, hold on. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Yeah, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Seriously, that's sixteen. So those are lined up. I'd have to bring this one back in one. Yeah, damn it. Oh, all right, I should be able to hop into bed real quick. We will continue the outline of the house. We will have no more grass! No more grass! Alright, I'm in bed. There we go. Oh, now see, that took quite a bit of my hunger that night. Okay. So I probably... I really don't want to do that. These break faster. The delay on placing some of the logs and such throws me every now and again. I don't think it actually has happened. I'm not sure if I'm hearing the sound effect. Maybe that's what it really is that's throwing me off. Could just be my sound effects are pretty quiet. Ah, uh, my crops are getting close to all being finished. Nice. Might I be able to snag a piece of wheat grain? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I could lure back some unsuspecting animals. <laughs> and I uh, have some yellow bell pepper. Uh, if I have one. Just one. I all. think I only have one. <laughs> oh well then. I, I'm not growing anything yet. This is just seeds that I found by smacking grass down. All right. All right. Let's uh, reposition this log here, and this time I'll know enough to get up on top. Then we can dig down on this side. Oh no, that's a that won't even chop down a single. single log with that axe. Watch me as I slowly chop down the tree. Ooh, can you make cake in this, uh, in here? I do not know. Love to make some cake. My birthday is tomorrow, apparently. <laughs> Let me see what day it is now. December 8th? So you were born on the 9th? Yep. Dude, so is my mom. Are you my mom? <laughs> no. Are you sure? I don't live in New York. How do you know? How do you know? <laughs> Maybe you're a uh, second personality that, you know, doesn't believe that you're in New York. Yeah. Because that would make sense. Totally. <laughs> Are you calling your mom crazy? No. Are you calling my mom crazy? You said she had two personalities. No, I didn't. I said you had two personalities. Uh-huh. Yeah. Oh, Jesus, seriously? All right, I will stand up here and chop from up here. Oi. That's kind of funny. I have two pigs and two sheep. Pigs are male and the sheep are female. <laughs> You're doing something wrong, man. <laughs> okay, unfortunately, I don't think I have enough oak. Oh, maybe I do. A couple more at least. Uh, I gripe and grumble about the amount of plank blocks I can carry as compared to the amount of slab blocks I can carry. 
but that would probably just get it fixed. And by fixed, I mean broken. Alright, it says the fire is burning. Or it shows it burning. It has a temperature gauge. But I guess it was actually out. Interesting. Yeah, I only have one yellow, pepper, yellow bell pepper seeds bag thingy. Alright, then don't worry about it. I'll get it. If I find another one, it'll be for you. But I think it's just harvest the peppers later. Is they go like a green, red, or green, yellow, red? I don't think they go yellow. No, they just they go... Did. No, I think red and yellow are separate. Uh, they go green, then either yellow or red, I think. Alright, we got I've been keeping a fairly close eye on these, and uh, they go from green to red. Hmm. Well, that would kind of suck. Okay, so I'm going to actually leave this balcony here stopping right there, but I am going to start another one on this side, and this will be uh, only accessible via this side of the house. One, two, and I'm not going to have enough. I really am going to need a huge tree farm, aren't I? Oi. Well, alrighty guys, um, I'm gonna continue working on my house a little bit. I'll get a floor in there, probably made out of hickory, or, you know, maybe I'll go out and find some, uh, white elm or something. Or maybe even the aspen, just see how it works. You know, I think I found some of that, the white elm. White elm? I think I, yeah. I think I might have planted it back at, uh, spawn house. Okay. But yeah, I'm just going to go out and wander. I'm going to collect some metals. I'm going to collect some uh, some lumber. And just, you know, overall general resource gathering. Uh, and we'll pick up in the, uh, the next episode with continuing on the house uh, and definitely getting into some of the metal stuff. Uh, we'll start up mines and things like that. Uh, oh, leather. We will be doing leather definitely at the next episode. This was just more of a... Let me get back into use to uh, the feeling of building and such like that in this game. And, you know, drive home how much you really need steel tools. <laughs> or at least iron. Or anything else that's not stone. Yeah. So anyway, thank you for watching. And I will talk to you guys next time. Have a good one.